Buried man here. We were given this crate which had a lot of rust on it. I need to get the rust off and then give it a paint job for our new pup. I'm going to show you how I got the rust off and then I applied three coats of paint and now she's ready to go. First thing I did was go over to Harbor Freight and pick up a wire wheel and cup set. We liberated this old pet cage from uh, some outlaws, I mean my in-laws. I'm going to use the wire brush, try to clean this up before we put some paint on it. You'll see significant rust on these wires. And we need to get that rust off before we put some paint. First of all, I'm going to try a two inch cup brush. It does okay, but it's beating me around pretty good. I'm gonna try largest wheel. Now I'm gonna try the smallest wheel. I got most of the rust off and you can see that steel shining and getting it ready to paint. I'm going to flip this over, get the other side of these rusty pieces and then it'll be ready to clean it off and get it ready to paint. Well everybody, that's how we did it. I used wire wheels and my cordless drill. Got the wire wheels at Harbor Freight with a little patience. Was able to get all the rust off and then with three coats of paint, she's ready to give us years of good service. If you're looking to do this kind of project, be mindful of your pet and use only pet safe paints. I used a paint with a brush because I knew I thought it would use a lot less paint and have better coverage than using spray cans. And I stick by that. I was able to buy a quart of paint for less than $10 at my local blue box store. And now I've got paint left over that I can use for another project. I used less than half that can. So I hope this was educational and I hope you learned something from uh, what I did. I had to learn as I go and I appreciate you watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. I hear my wife calling. I gotta go.